having the gyro shaker, the control panel is here, that is the emergency switch button. Push to open, there's the tray. Once you pull this tray out, there's a different grooves on, the, on this panel to fit every can. So we're shaking the four liters. You're going to put it on the central place, match the groove. Since the, the handle is loose, you'll fasten it to avoid noise or any distraction inside. The handle is fastened and the tin is positioned well. Lock it back, make sure it locks. Pull back the cover to close the lid. The time is set to 60 seconds, that is one minute for the four liters. Press start, you can see it clamping. Once it's fastened, the jiving starts. So that the colorants and the bases can mix to form the shade that was desired. So from the control panel, there's a screen that shows the time lapsing once the 60 seconds has lapsed. Now the shaker will release the tin again. Once it's finished, it will tell you mixing finished. You are allowed to open the lid now. Pull out the tray. Pick out your paint. Make sure it's always closed. We'll head up to shaking the 20 liters. There is always this belt that is provided where when, when you're given the shaker, fasten the handle so that it doesn't make some noise. The same process as for the four liters. Make sure it's centralized. Once the drum is positioned, lock the machine. Now, we'll use the multi-can button because it's automated to 180 seconds. That is three minutes for the, for the drum. You can see on the control panel, it's automated to 180 seconds, that is three minutes. Because now it will be a smooth rotation for the drum as per the weight. Once we are done mixing, remove the drum. So this is the last step. Once we are done with the dispensing and shaking, we have to come to this step where there is color confirmation. We have to check if the shade we've dispensed matches the color chart as per desired. Now this is geranium. Remember we had dispensed it earlier. Geranium super gloss 1x4. I'll just go ahead and open it. It should be red in color. And there we have our red. This is a brush out card. This for I have to spread some of the paint here. So I'll just mark it first with a sticker for geranium down there using a clean brush for the super gloss I'll pick just a small amount spread it on the brush make sure you go one direction once that's done make sure you give it time to dry up do the same for the silk we are done by finalizing it put a dot on top of the lid so that the it can be checked before being opened. Make sure you clean your, bra you clean your brush with a solvent, either white spirit or a standard thinner. Once the shades are dried up, remember we had picked those shades from the BS4800. That is where we had, the, our selection was from. When I put this like this, you can totally see it's the same thing. This is the desired paint. And this is what we have given. Done with that. Let's check sulfate. This is what we've just formulated right now. And this is the shade card. What you can see, it matches. <laughs>